Attention, New Orleans Saints fans. We have exclusive, breaking news about Alvin Kamara, one of the key players on our beloved team. The talented running back is looking to renegotiate his contract before the start of the 2024 season, which could significantly impact the team. According to an ESPN report, Kamara missed the last day of minicamp due to contract issues. He currently has two years remaining on his contract, with a salary of $11.8 million for this year. However, the real issue arises in 2025, where his contract includes an unguaranteed sum of $25 million. This figure, although impressive, is not in the Saints' plans, as they do not intend to pay it, according to analyst Jeremy Fowler. Kamara, who will turn 29 in July, signed a five-year contract worth a total of $75 million in 2020. This deal included a base salary of $22.4 million for the 2025 season, a figure that was always expected to be renegotiated. Despite this amount artificially inflating the value of Kamara's contract, it was almost certain to be adjusted or renegotiated at some point. Last year, Kamara missed four games due to injuries and experienced a slight decline in his performance as an all-around playmaker. He rushed for a career-low 694 yards and scored five touchdowns. Additionally, as a receiver, he totaled 466 yards and one touchdown on 75 receptions, averaging 6.2 yards per catch, also a career low. Despite this slight drop, Kamara surpassed 1,000 total yards for the seventh consecutive season, demonstrating his value and versatility on the field. Kamara is not seeking a long-term contract extension, but rather a restructuring that provides him with greater financial security in the short term, either this season or next. E I understand what has been said, doing something different and everyone being here, Jakamara commented after skipping the last day of mandatory minicamp. E for me, I just stuck to what I know. I don't think any of my teammates were really offended. I talk to a lot of them almost every day. It is what it is. There are different things pulling from one side to another. Last year I had a family. It's not something pulling at me. The most stressful thing for me right now is that my rear left tire has low pressure. Everything else, I'm fine. I feel great. That's all. I feel good, I'm doing what I've always done. So far, the talks between Kamara and the Saints have not advanced significantly. There is a possibility that Kamara may decide not to participate in training camp if an agreement is not reached by the end of July. The Saints have not made significant changes to their running back lineup this offseason, putting Kamara in a relatively strong position. He is clearly superior to his veteran teammates Jamal Williams and second-year running back Kendra Miller. Therefore, the Saints might try to appease Kamara by offering him a few additional million dollars, with the prospect that this could be his last season in New Orleans. What do you think about Kamara's move at the negotiating table? Subscribe, like, and leave us your comment on this crucial moment for our team.